Hey guys, here's your gaming news for today, Friday, March 13th. You can find the source links in the description below to learn more about each topic. Mortal Kombat X's Season Pass for $24.99 will add four playable characters to the game's roster, including Jason Voorhees. Jason will later be joined by a second special guest character and two classic Mortal Kombat combatants. The PS3 and Xbox 360 versions of Mortal Kombat X have been delayed worldwide to this summer. High Voltage Software, not NetherRealm Studios, is developing Mortal Kombat X on PS3 and Xbox 360, as well as Windows PC. The PC, PlayStation 4, and Xbox One versions are still set to launch April 14th. Destiny has taken home the award for best game during last night's 2015 British Academy Games Awards. This is Bungie's fourth BAFTA win, but remains the first win outside of the studio's long-running Halo franchise. Respawn Entertainment has confirmed that its free DLC promotion for Titanfall has no time restrictions, with all three expansions free to download forever. Titanfall's trio of expansions usually cost $10 each in the U.S. The announcement to offer the content for free was partly to mark the game's one-year anniversary. Goat Simulator, which developer Coffee Stain Studios calls the world's dumbest game, is headed to Xbox One and Xbox 360 this April. The Xbox versions of the game are being developed by Double Eleven, which has previously developed PC ports of several Pixel Junk games. Microsoft has yet to say when exactly in April Goat Simulator will hit the Xbox platform or what the game will cost. On PC, the game is currently $10. Rockstar Games has announced an update is currently available for the PlayStation 4 and PlayStation 3 versions of Grand Theft Auto Online. The update is said to address fixes for GTA Online stability, as well as a few other small tweaks for both online and story mode. Rockstar confirms the same update will come to the Xbox One and Xbox 360 as soon as possible. Evolve is getting two new DLC maps, both free of charge, available on Xbox One on March 31st and then on PlayStation 4 and PC on April 30th. Both maps are available for hunt, nest, and rescue modes through skirmish, custom matches, and evacuation campaigns. And that's our news for today. Join us again on Monday for games industry coverage as it unfolds. Good night, everyone.